Yo, YouTube, what's going on? It's your boy Beam. We got a big package today. I think this is from Gamma. So, y'all know what time it is. I'm back focused. I'm back on my grind. I'm back doing my YouTube thing. So, y'all know we applying pressure. We come to y'all with some of the best and new products that hit the industry. We got the Gamma Instinct right here. Let me go ahead and open this top. I know we got a lot of other influencers that's used these. We got Jeezy in rotation with them. Sean Cuss here showed them off. Um... Bossio been using them. It's a couple of us uh, different influencers who've been using them, but I'm finna just go ahead give y'all my quick little insight. Oh yeah, I'm give y'all my insight on these real quick. As you guys can see, man, these are beautiful. They super small too, like in terms of compact. Like you look at my hand, my hand is bigger than the clipper, so it's gonna fit in my hand super perfect. It's super light in terms of flicking, click. It got the uh. It got the click mechanism, file click mechanism. You could take that out if you don't like the click mechanism. Let's hear what they sound like. You could tell that's RPM. You could tell that's power. What we finna do is we're gonna do a nice dope fade with these. These are beautiful. I love them. I like this Iron Man look. I like this new modern day look in terms of clippers. These are fire to me. Let everybody say what they wanna say. But you know, Beam, I'm a little bit different with my Clippers. I stayed a Masters fan when everybody went cordless. So with that being said, like, I'm I'm really a fan of these. I like how these look. I can't wait to see how these cut. And let me not forget that I got the trimmers to these as well. I got the trimmers to these as well. I had got the trimmers sent a couple weeks ago, but I had to send them out. So I couldn't do an unboxing because I had to make sure that they were thoroughly checked. But as you guys can see, this is the dual setup. Uh, the clipper itself right here and the trimmer itself right here. The blade looks really good on it. It's a thin blade. Body feel good. It's kind of bigger up top. I wish it was just a slight bit slimmer up top, but in terms of how the clipper feel in my hand, both of the clippers feel really good. So this video is going to be dedicated to doing a haircut with both of these clippers. I'm going to be using the actual clipper to cut the hair, then I'm be using the trimmer to line the hair up. Without further ado, we finna get into this video, we finna check it out, and then I'll come and talk to y'all towards the end of the review to let y'all know my first time impression with the Gamma Instincts. Without further ado, let's lock in, let's have fun, let's get to it. Yeah, I know how I, I know how it go. <laughs> All right, bro. What are we doing today? All right, we getting uh basically a drop fade. Okay. Just cleaning the sides up a little bit, so just a drop fade, bring the beard down to like a two. But you want to keep the beard as wide as possible, though, right? Like give it, give it as yeah, you, you wide keep as keep, keep it as high as possible. Um, I usually um go like where it's at right there, like that line right there. Yeah, like right under here. Yeah. You okay. Cool. Right there, and then. Yeah, so you do a two against the grain, you do a close like I'm talking about. Oh, uh, I got a, well, I got a weird beard too. So like right here, yeah, this is another thing you get like. So basically, this side grows straight, but this side grows a little funny. So usually okay. it's kind of just like this is like width, and then this is like a, like against. You know okay. what I'm saying? Because you that's see, cool. it, it kind of got a little cow lick in here. You see that? That's, on the that's a bet. And with the curls just in the ridge area, I'm gonna give it some shape to yeah, it. Yeah, too, yeah, yeah, just right here. Like you don't gotta really like. I mean, even hmm, the front. I ain't gonna. Know. I'm not gonna cut it, bro. It look good. <laughs> I, I'm saying I like the curl look. Yeah. How it look now or whatever. If you want me to, I will. But it look good with the curls. If I just like clean up the ends and everything and give it some shape on the sides, I think it'll look. Yeah, yeah it'll exactly. Look pretty yeah. Good. All right, cool. And then the back, you. if there's like a little straggler back there, like you could just like hit it. You know what I'm saying? Like, okay. Little... I got you, bro. Yo, YouTube, what up? What's going on? It's your boy Beam, and today we got one of them bangers in the chamber. If you're new to my channel, please like, share, subscribe, comment, hit that notification bell to get alerted when new videos come out. Let's get right to it. So as you guys can see, we got a curly top. My client said he basically wants to do like a drop slash mid face, so it won't be too droppy, but it'll be in the mid area. I'm going to create my first ball line with the instincts, and I want to give myself enough room to be able to create a clean guideline through and through all the way through the client head just to ensure that I could create a nice you know reference line to basically run this fade all the way through even when I'm completely open with my clippers or when I got my guards as you guys can see now I'm using my shaver to basically ball it out as low as possible now completely open using my gamma style instinct trimmers and I want to focus on giving myself at least you know an inch guideline to really raise the guideline so I could create a nice trim 
transition um, between the ball area and where the hair starts to fade. So now I'm gonna drop them completely halfway right here. I wanna start to create that transition slowly but surely, but I wanna get a consistentness. I wanna fill these clippers for what they truly are, seeing that I never used them before and it's my first time. You know, review now completely closed and they just cutting through the hair and you can hear them every time they cut through a piece of hair. You can hear a crunch, you can hear a hit. And that's something that I look for in clippers when they come to clippers, especially like cutting clippers. Y'all know me. I was a Masters fan, not a wireless Masters, but a wired Master fan before all of this stuff. And one thing that excited me was always hearing those pings when I was able to hit the hair. Now we go in with a number one guard. And this is completely open. I'm going to give myself another half inch to an inch guideline to create more room because I know that that one going to be really my foundation for majority of my fade before I start to get into the bulk area so you know I'm gonna give myself some room and set up for a nice taper always remember brush one fade one now halfway here and just staying consistent and just you know trying to get that feathered effect I'm just gonna keep working on it I'm gonna stay solid on what I'm doing and you know just keep working on it big shout out to my dog germ booming man I had a big 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 crazy mess up with my computer this weekend um, I lost a lot of like my beats my samples and things but I went through one of my uh, thumbnail folders and for some reason this I can't stop loving you was in there and y'all remember this from a while ago like come on who don't like I can't stop loving you by Kim this is one of the greatest songs of all time greatest R&B joints so it's like no, I had to just go ahead and throw that in there. So shout out to my dog Jern, man. This was a crazy, crazy, crazy sample. So it's fly, like it's slow. I can talk over it, like it's just clean. So as you guys see, I'm slowly but surely creating that transition. Everything is coming together really well, and you know that feathered effect is coming. Taking my time. Fire. Remember everything that you do like literally starts with you when it come down to fade and it come down to line and then everything you do you got to be creative behind the chair and you just got to make sure that you ensure all of the techniques that you know so what I'm doing on the top of the beard is what I did on the side of the head but in reverse effect start open drop them halfway completely closed and we're starting to slowly but surely get a transition within the beard you want to be able to bring a lot of your elements and techniques that you do throughout the head and every part of the head to keep it consistent as possible and anybody that know beam i preach consistency more than any barber ever on youtube could ever do because at the end of the day consistency is it for me and you know that's what helped me to grow to who i am i can't speak for other barbers and things of that nature but i can tell y'all y'all know me consistency is literally in my dictionary it's damn near the name of my dictionary so with that being said stay consistent with what you're doing keep your techniques through and through throughout the head and now going in with a number two guard completely open just riding the corner parts of my blade across the parietal ridge area of the head to not deep bulk but to feather this area really you know so i could still get keep the heaviness but also not make it too dense or too heavy with that being said that is allowing me to get my fade you know how i want to as you guys can see i'm just sitting them on the corner or the the corner of the blades and riding across the parietal ridge area of the head and just really ensuring that I could get a nice feathered effect. With that being said, fire. Clean. You gotta love it. You gotta love it. Shout out to Gamma for this. If you guys want to get the Gamma style uh, instincts, the clipper or the trimmer, you guys can use the code beam. The code beam will be in literally the bottom of the description. Well, not the bottom of the description. Once you click description, it'll be at the top of the description with my Tomb 45 products and things of that nature. And that's how you get, you know, discounted products at Gamma uh, and style craft so please you know if you want to be able to get these clippers at least get them for a discount and use my discount code beam i think you guys will be really surprised by the gamma instincts the clipper and the trimmer because they're both gonna show out in this video today as you guys can see we get to the right side of the head and y'all know me i preach consistency through and through you just follow the same things that you do on one side to the other side it's like applying math and finding common denominators with that being said when it come to my right side y'all know i like to connect 
like, you know, to the world and connect to the people in the world, you know, that's just going through things or that's just, you know, figuring out life one piece by one piece. And one thing that I can always tell myself is when it comes to something that you love to do, if you got a passion for anything that it is, stay focused on your passion. Because at the end of the day, a lot of people won't see your vision. But at the end of the day, I tell y'all all the time, it's not about you breaking the vision down to somebody it's about sitting next to like-minded people that's something that was real big man i left chicago i left my home base i left what felt like home to come and connect more with the bossios with the fonzes with the drays with tomb docs and things of that nature to get closer to what i actually love and if i stayed in chicago yeah i would have still been beam i still would have been able to drop a lead here because but at the end of the day me as a businessman i wouldn't have been able to grow because none of my my friends in Chicago were business oriented and man, a lot of them were just hard workers and with that being said, you can work hard but if you don't have a business part together, you can never scale yourself to be bigger than that. With that being said, anybody in this comment section who wants to be an entrepreneur, a content creator, whatever it is that you want to do or want to be, put yourself in a circle with those people and that's how you become that. We all know that. You know, you stick yourself around four millionaires, you'll be the fifth one. You stick yourself around four broke people, you gonna be the fifth one. And that's just how it is. Influence is everything in this world. Stay focused, stay true to who you are, enjoy doing what you do. And man, like skies is the limit, but it's really not. We got galaxies for a reason, exceed expectations. So now I'm gonna connect the back. I wanna go in completely open using the gamma style instincts and I'm gonna drop them halfway right here. And I just wanna fade in between slowly but surely, but I'm just trying to bring the fade together, feather it in together and create Create this consistentness and really connect it. Completely open with a one guard now, combing one, fading one. I'm gonna drop them halfway now, and then I'm gonna drop them completely closed. And as you guys can see, I'm just slowly but surely creating this feathered effect of bringing everything together with this fade. Just staying solid as possible, enjoying what I'm doing, staying true to my system, and making everything happen at the highest level, because that's what it's about for me. When you come to Beam Channel, I'm gonna do it at the highest level. I'm gonna do it and make it look easy. Because I follow my system And that's what I tell all of my upcoming barbers When you are a barber or you want to be a barber Find you a system that works for you in terms of fading and lining And when you fade it, apply and use it to every haircut Because once you're able to use it and apply it to every haircut You'll never be in a predicament where you're stuck in terms of creating transition Or creating dope or clean or sharp razor lines Because at the end of the day, this thing is about consistency It's about, like I said, common denominator is doing to what you do on one side to the other side to create symmetrical looks for all of your clients and that's what's gonna help you achieve the looks and things that you want to do so i'm gonna go in i'm gonna comb the hair down and now i'm using my razor liner man we got a dope 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 product coming out i'm coming out with my own holding spray it took us a long time shout out to my dog dre and tune 45 who allowed me to do it i'm doing some test runs right here for you guys because i haven't completely finished the labeling and i haven't gave it its hundred percent name but as you guys can see we got our razor line spray that's coming out and it's gonna be ridiculous when i tell y'all ridiculous i'm gonna be able to get them things completely crispy and i know a lot of you guys always ask me what type of spritz or hole of spray that i do use and i'm bringing that to the market to you guys as you guys can see and since i came to florida i didn't drop three products since i've been in florida i dropped my pencils you know <laughs> i didn't drop my my fibers like i didn't drop Drop some stuff and now I'm going here and finna drop the razor line and spray for you guys. And we finna take it to another level because when I came out here, business is what we attacked. And as you guys can see, I'm just creating frame out work. I did behind the beard, front of the lineup, top of the mustache, bottom of the mustache. All of this is framework to keep me in that box. As you guys can see, my client got a couple like, you know, lighter spots in the front. Not that he's losing his hair, but he got calyx in the front that allows his hair to grow back. With that being said, you gotta go in and sometimes you gotta assist it with like the colors and things to bring it to life and because i didn't have my sean cuts hair color enhancement car i'm using my style craft to my new blaze that i didn't put on my clippers because it was super straight edged and you know it fit the product right then and there and that's one thing that i teach on my channel as well you don't have to have the best things in the world or the biggest products in the world to do some of the craziest looks you just you know use what you got and now i'm using my tomb 45 percent Precision pack pencil 
best pencil on the market if you need 245 pencils or products period hit the description box down below and i promise you you get a discount code soon as you hit my toon 45 link is already attached to that code you hit that you go in there you either get your pencils your fibers your no drip color your bean team coilers compressor coilers map shaving gel whatever it is that you want you hit that link to get all discounted products on toon 45 website and as you guys see these gamma style instincts cutting through that pencil beautifully it's dispersing the color across the skin and doing what the pencil needs to do not stretch it my client's skin angle in my right at a 45 degree angle with the client completely leaned back i'm bringing everything back to the highest point that you guys seen them say in a video i want to get this nice crispiness this symmetrical look and i never cut this client hair before i'm just you know doing what being do i'm in my own world i'm in my own lane and i'm just you know having fun just doing what i do and as you guys can see look at that razor line and spritz that i'm showing you guys as i stretch the the skin it's not even assisted with the pencil is creating that white crack line and y'all know we like that on my channel because this is for my kodak moments when i take pictures behind the chair this is why my pictures look so crispy because it really is crispy now i don't let the clients walk out the shop with the white lines on the face or on the forehead i you know sometimes gotta remind the clients that this is all for video purpose to show a high level of precision and crispiness throughout the videos you know it just helped me on my kodak moments Repeat the same steps here, stretch the skin, angle that razor at a 45 degree angle, bring everything back to the highest point. I'm staying consistent and I'm throwing through. Again, fire. It's clean, dog. It's clean. It's clean. It's clean. Like, it don't get no cleaner than that. Shout out to. Gamma for coming through, letting me test out some of the clippers, the haircutting clippers and the trimmer. If you want these trimmers or if you want the clippers themselves, remember, you got a discount code BEAM. The discount code is BEAM in all capital letters on Gamma or Stylecraft website. And the same thing with Tune 45. You go, you go to Tune 45, you click my link in the bio, and you get all of your products discounted off. It's attached to the link already. So we super clean. In the imperfect world, we do get these clients that come in looking crazy by the head. My dog Faye was looking insane. Only the curls was popping. But y'all know, as barbers, it's up to us to change that outcome. And without further ado, let's lock in. Hashtag TBT in that comment section. Hashtag glass. Y'all know what time it is. It's 2023. It's year elevation. We focus on bringing y'all some of the dopest looks, some of the dopest transformations. And man, we taking this year over one by one. If you're new to my channel, please like, share, subscribe, comment, hit that notification bell to get alerted when new videos come out. And until next time, may God bless. I appreciate you all for watching me. And let's check out what the clients say. In the mirror. Sheesh. How you feel about it? <laughs> hey, all right, you two. As y'all can see, that was my client's reaction to him getting his haircut. First time client, first time I cut his hair. And I think it came out, and it's a banger. If you want to get them your information so they can follow you on your Instagram and your YouTube. Uh, Miami underscore Ami. Actually, I think it's just Miami, M-E-A-M-I. Follow me, man. Best music reviews out there, man. Yes, best music reacting videos out there. His name would be somewhere towards the bottom of here. Um, my overall thought of the instincts, these are fire. First time using these trimmers out the box on this brand new client. Fade came out clean. Lineup came out clean. Man, Gamma did they thing with these. These are fire. Until next time, Jesus. man, we out of here.